how you guys doing servers here today we we're back for another call of duty video today i'm gonna be teaching you guys how to play hard point like some of the pro players that you guys see in cdl there are a lot of things that you guys need to know one of the most important things that you guys will need to know is how to control spawns if you haven't watched that video first i highly recommend watching that video first to gain some insight and then come back and watch this video link to that video will be down in the description below if you have made it this far into the video chances are you either have already watched that video or have a pretty good understanding on how spawns work in cold war first off spawns are one of the most important things that you guys will need to know be able to control in a respawn game mode like hardpoint control these spawns uh, you want to pl will play a pivotal role in deciding whether you have a chance of winning a game or losing if you fail to hold spawns for the new rotation of hard points this can make it extremely difficult when trying to set up for the next rotation and it could cost you a decent amount of time and points because you're consistently trying to fight for spawns and hard next hard point next what you guys are going to want to do is know how your opponent plays if they are leaning towards the aggressive side pushing you and they're always in your face or are they more of waiting and waiting to push for you to push them and then setting up another thing is you guys are going to want to establish rules what i mean by this is that there are four different roles in a hard point they all have their own assign assignments first is an anchor the anchor will lock down spawns for the next uh, hard point the anchor has one of the most important jobs as they're consistently thinking about grabbing the next spawns for the next hard point then you have a slayer Slayer will sit around a hard point, trying to do his best to protect the player that is in the hard point. Next, you guys have the support and OBJ. These rules are similar. The only difference is the support only plays objective when the OBJ player dies. Once you guys figure out these rules, you guys can start practicing these rules. Make sure that you are running OBJ. Make sure the OBJ and the support are running trophy systems to help against grenades. Another tip that I have for you guys is learning rotations and be able to rotate early. What I recommend is going to a private match start a hard point game and just go through the motions of rotating typically I usually like to rotate uh, at 15 seconds keep in mind you should at least have one player stay behind on the old hard point and trying to get the last 15 seconds for your team the last tip I have for you guys is knowing when to push hard point or just rotate to the next one um, if you can't break a hard point when the timer hits 20 seconds I usually forget about that hard point and start the rotation to the next one and set up make sure you guys are ready to go um, yes, you guys are going to be down 20 points, but if you set up and lock down the next hard point and hold it, you guys can have a chance to hold that hard point the entire time and be up. If you are holding, um, you know, if you're holding that hard point, you guys are going to be up in points. So you guys really won't really have to worry about that 20 seconds or those 20 points. If you guys enjoyed this video, please do go ahead and leave a like. Hopefully it did help you guys. You guys are new to the channel make sure you guys go ahead hit the subscribe button hit the bell for notifications and then comment down below if this video helped you guys or if you guys have more guys that you guys would like to see on how to play certain game modes or certain maps let me know in the comment section down below other than that guys i'll catch you guys later peace out